In today's video, I'm going to teach you how to change the Outlook folder font size, whether you're looking to make the text easier to read or simply prefer a different look. Adjusting the font size in Outlook is a quick and simple process. We'll walk through this together, step by step, to ensure you get those settings just how you want them. First, let's begin by opening Microsoft Outlook on your computer. If you're accessing Outlook through your web browser, simply navigate to the Outlook website. Once you have the application or website open, look to the top right corner of your screen where you'll see the sign in option if you aren't already signed in. Click this and you'll be prompted to enter your email and password. If you have multiple accounts, make sure you select the right one for the changes you want to make. Once you're successfully signed in, we'll be looking for the settings icon, which again can be found in the top right corner. This is usually represented by a gear symbol, a standard icon you'll recognize from many applications. Click on this icon to open the settings menu. It's in this menu that you can customize various aspects of your Outlook experience, including our focus today, the folder font size. In the menu that appears, you'll want to look for the section labeled text size and spacing. This is where the magic happens. Here, you'll see options to choose from different font sizes, ranging from small to large. Take a moment to consider your preference and select the font size that suits your needs best. If you're not sure, you can try each one and see how it looks before deciding. After selecting your desired font size, the final step is crucial. Don't forget to click on save to ensure your changes take effect. Without saving, all your preferences will be lost and you'll have to start over again. So double check that you've hit that save option before exiting the settings menu. And there you have it. In just a few minutes, you've customized the font size in your Outlook folders to match your personal preferences. This simple adjustment can greatly enhance your readability and overall user experience, making navigating your emails much more comfortable. Thank you for joining me today in this straightforward tutorial. By following these steps, you should now be adept at customizing this particular aspect of your Outlook setup. If you found this video helpful, don't forget to like and subscribe for more tips and tutorials. Until next time, happy emailing.